Here are the best hiding spots for the new map, the Fungal, that you can use to hide from the Seeker. You can hide behind the rock that is located in the middle of the map. In the Seeker's POV, Seekers can't see you well, and there's a rock that can hide you. You can also vent in here to prepare if the Seeker is so close. You can also hide near the dropship, a location that Seekers won't search, and you can also vent in case there's trouble coming. Wanna be invisible? In the jungle location, you can hide behind these plants to make yourself invisible. So here's the best hiding spot in the jungle. You can also use the small green mushrooms scattered throughout the map, which will release a pinkish-purplish gas into the air, causing the seeker to lose sight of other hiders while in it. You can also hide throughout the beach, located at the left corner of the map. Seekers will never find you here due to the low vision. Well, you can also hide in the splash zone so that you're securely not caught by the seeker. You can also hide on the dock watching the beautiful beach. Yeah, it's so obvious. But trust me, it works. You can also hide behind the big crystals and it will make you invisible. Just find the spot that even your single skin can't be seen by others. Here's also one of my favorites hiding spots. Hide behind these wall made out of woods and outplay the seeker. You can also use these binoculars to watch the chaos. Isn't it amazing? You can also vent if it's time for the final hide. You can also hide in front of the big crystals, and the Seeker will likely ignore you for sure. You can hide in the dropship, as it's far from the Seeker, making it difficult for them to find you. Outside of the greenhouse, there's a spot where Seekers are less likely to see you because of the glass in front of you. It's also a good hiding spot when the Seeker have ability to seek. You can hide near the docks as it's far from the map, ensuring the Seeker won't find you easily. In the laboratory, you can hide behind the glass to conceal yourself, and you can see through it if the seeker passes by to catch you. You can also vent if you believe the seeker has truly spotted you. These are the colors you should use for camouflage, depending on where you're hiding, so the seeker is less likely to see you. Also, these are the visors you should use to hide your light visor. Did you notice I don't have a name in Among Us? So, how to get it? I will make a new video about this and make sure you're subscribed.